I believe in this year, I will finish one thing that I have never done before. And that is, I will go to the United States. <laughs> Not by plane, but by boat. Wow. Wow. That's cool, cool, right? Is that I know the, the entire whole journey will take a month, but that's okay. Because I got summer vacations and you know I don't have to go to summer school and all that kind of stuff, kind of school. No, no that stuff. Not anymore. This time, this summer, I'm going to USA by boat. <laughs> <laughs> but what happened after I arrived in the United States? Gotta do something, right? So I'm planning um, go to the United States in San Francisco. You know, it's a coastland um, city. So I went there, took some photos, and tell everyone I'm safely done my journey, safe and sound. And after that, I'm going to visit my couple friends there. You know, we have two friends living in San Francisco, and one is in uh, Los Angeles. They can take some trains over there, visit them, have a little fan chat, and you know, take care of each other. And that is all my dream. Thank you. <laughs> So great. So, our next question is, please tell us one of your achievements. One goal that you have achieved and how it changes you. For me, I was a little bit chubby at the last year of high school. You know, we all study hard, <laughs> so we get a little bit chubby, not bad, okay. So, one of my, uh, one of my goals is to get back into shape and be healthy. And after three year effort, I finally finished my first triathlon last summer. Wow. And I learned that and I learned that how to deal with my physical pain and my fear underwater. So anyone want to share one of his or her achievements? Ooh, ooh. Oh great. Ooh. Hi everyone, my name is Margit and uh, this is my first time to come here and it's not very nice to meet everyone and I just want to share one of my experience I just oh, uh, uh, when, I was in, uh, when I was in the first grade of senior high school uh, I was like 15 years old something like that and um, I went to uh, Vancouver by myself uh, because I really like to travel around the world and then I asked my mom and dad if I could go out by myself and they said yes so I went to I chose Vancouver and I think that was a really great experience because um, I really love, love my home state family because uh, my home dad, he is very cool. He, he really loves uh, music. So he bought, uh, there was uh, one piano, one electronic piano, one, drum, one set of drums, and one bass, and one guitar, electronic guitar in his home. So uh, he, uh, I asked him if, I, if he could teach me how to play the drums, and he said yes, and I learned something from him. And uh, he also has a a friend, uh, which he has met when he was very young. And um, her name was her, her name is Sandy. And I, I asked her if he sh if she sh could teach me some guitar. And she just come to my home and give me three lessons. And I think it's very I really appreciate that and. I really want to go back and visit them again. And uh, through this trip, I also uh, improved my English and meet some new friends. And uh, I think it's a very, um, very good experience and everyone should have one. Thank you. So the next question is 
So, uh, okay. So we have, after we, when we want something so much, we work so hard, we plan for our goals, we get really stressful. So the next question is, what did you do to distress? What did you do to relax? I mean, for me, I write. I write all of my dirty thoughts, you know this, <laughs> down, and I throw them away, just like a ritual. And it works for me. It really works for me. So um, any want, want to share, let's hear it away. Okay, Sunny, let's walk up. Hello everyone, my name is Sunny, and this is my first time to stand on this stage. Uh, I broke up with my ex-boyfriend a month ago, and I feel very depressed. In order to eliminate this bad mood, I, I see lots of movie I, I really like see I really like to see ghost movie <laughs> <laughs> why does it make you distressed and relax uh, did you know, scream the... did you scream and yeah <laughs> did you like to look at alone watch it alone or I usually watch alone in your, your home, in yeah, your house, in, your, in my room, in your room. But <laughs> 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 um, what do you have any recommendation? <laughs> like what is your favorite uh, horror movie or? I forgot the name. <laughs> yeah. Or did you usually watch movie or is there a series or you, you like? I like. I like. Yes. <laughs> Okay, and, and and is there other ways you do you eat something? Did you eat a lot when you watch the horror movie? Yeah. What did you usually eat? Eat some chips. Chips. Yeah. And <laughs> and other greasy food. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So much. Okay, so people say that most plan that fails it is because that we forgot we people need to rest. So some suggest that we should plan our vacation prior to our work. How do you think about that? So the next question is, do you have a plan for a vacation? Do you have a plan for, for example, the coming spring break is in several weeks. Do you have a plan for it, summer vacation? Or just some little trip on the weekend. For um, for example, I take my friends. One of my friends, for example, she went to uh, she went to trips alone every. She went travel alone every summer and winter vacation. She went to amazing places like Cambodia, Iceland, Morocco, and uh, yeah, just a lot of amazing places all on her own, with her own money, and with her own plan, own special spots she finds. She's always excited, always planning for her next trip. So anyone has a vacation that plan? Anyone want to try? Any, you want to? Okay. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Our plan, I really want to travel Taiwan um, again, but um, I really want to go to the place. It's also Taizong. Um, our Toastmasters outing go to Taizong last year, and we live in BNB and by Jamie's uh, family, held by Jamie's family. <laughs> but <laughs> it's really, really nice place. Her mother is very kind, and uh, the food here is very delicious. And um, I want to go to here um, again because the scenery here is very beautiful and uh, I want to know more about the Aboriginal place. Mm. Any questions? <laughs> 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 uh, 
um, just um, I want to go to here again, and um, I want to go to the see the um, the place called San Xian Tai to see the sun rays. But before we go to San Xian Tai, um, the last night we would like to sleep early. Yeah. Because <laughs> and that, that day we play the table game until 2 a.m. and we wake up in 4 a.m. and <laughs> drive the car and ask Jessica to drive very quick and go to the sun and to see the sun rays. It's very very beautiful and but however it's a little dangerous for me. <laughs> and um oh the time is so quick. <laughs> I want to share more about the Taidong place. It is very uh, historical place and beautiful. The scenery here is um, very touching, and the, um, the story here is very. Uh, I want to tell you, but the time is very short. So this is our last question, and this is especially for a freshman and someone first time here. So. It is our dream that keep us on working and keep us happy at the same time. So what did you wish to become within the year, within the university years? What do you want to achieve? What do you, is it, do you want to get a boyfriend or a girlfriend? Do, would you like to compete in a Toastmaster speech competition? Or did you like to uh, form a lifestyle, like be a fashion icon or something? So, anyone, anyone want to share these are her thoughts? Any, anyone you? Come on, come on. Or I'll be, oh, okay, great. Let's get another round of applause. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Um, I, I I want to be a person um, um, when I'm in high school. Uh, I study for for the Gaokao, and uh, I uh, and uh, I make a uh, uh, a lot of plan to uh, to to make um, to make me to make me study well. And when when I go to the university, uh, I lost my. I lost my goals, uh, <laughs> goals, goals, and and uh, and, uh, and no and uh, no 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 plan, and uh, I just uh, play computer game, play, uh, <laughs> play computer games, and uh, um, and go to the gym, and uh, do some do some. Uh, and do some um, some kind of use useless things. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I uh, and uh, this year is my last year in university. I want to um, to redef to redefine myself and uh, to uh, to uh, plan for my future. And uh, I want to be a computer scientist and uh, but uh, now I, I do the some uh, I in I major in business uh, so it it will be a big change uh, I want I want I can be better thank you okay let's give our time